Welcome. I know our little camp doesn't look like much, but it's home. After all, what is home but a place where people love you? I am Lord Crass, heir to Dolve Arn, and soon to be mayor of New Culm. Ah, I'm glad you asked. The village of Culm was a place of peace, of prosperity. Now it is little more than ashes and bones. But by burning our homes, the Tuatha have kindled in us a fire for survival. We will build a new Kuln. All I need is the gold to support this bold undertaking, possibly by retrieving the treasures of Kuln. Care to help? There are many valuables, but only a chosen few will fetch the kind of gold we need to begin construction. A painting, an urn, a box, and some jewelry. A nobler soul I've never met. Now, here is what I intend to do, because like all good leaders, I have a plan. My plan involves the treasures of Kalm. The people of this good village were not mere farmers, but members of the highest strata. Their collection of valuables was truly second to none. To safeguard those possessions, and because many proved cumbersome on this long journey, they hid them. I want you to bring them to me. Sadly, we will need to sell them. Goodbye. Stop staring at me, I didn't do anything. Bye.
Remarkable. The treasures of Calm. They... they are more beautiful than I remember. This is truly an achievement. One that will shape the days to come, I promise you. You will have it, as you deserve something equal to the great service you have done me and the refugees. I have acquired many tools and weapons during this long journey west. I have set them aside to use in constructing new Calm, but I now offer them to you. You are welcome to one item from my private hoard as thanks. Ehrlich will accompany you, of course. His spear may come in handy along the way. Goodbye. I'm not in the mood to talk. Hmm. Well, here we are. It's time to get started. And by that I mean I'm supposed to kill you, here, away from the eyes of the refugees. As you've probably guessed, there is no reward. There never was. Crass is probably halfway to Rathia by now. Never trust nobles, my friend. Even false ones. Now, I'm not in the mood for killing at the moment, but orders are orders. 
I suppose you're right. He never did treat me well, tricky fellow. You know what? You go and give him a scare. Bloated fool deserves it. I saw you coming. Hope you'd visit. Just about mad with worry. What with the Freeman room in the hills and caverns. Tell me, child, have you noticed a young woman about? She's quite fair, with red hair, a tattoo like mine across her cheek. It's been three days. My newfound love, and the only person I have. Everyone, my wife, my son, my grandchildren, all of them were killed in the attacks. Nothing remains but Lyra. She and several of her friends went in search of a better place to make our camp. This wretched son takes its toll, doesn't it? But they never returned, and, and I worry. Would you do an old man this one kindness? Would you help me find her? Thank you. I am not rich. Not anymore. But what I have left to give is yours. It means nothing without my love. Lyra went in search of refuge in Oriator's tomb. A better place than this desolate cliff. I would try the cemetery on the hill where they buried all the old war heroes. Goodbye, and good luck. How would Grind say? You're accepted here to this keep. The Saken Plains contract takes a particular sort to pull a ring out of a grave like that. Here's your pay. Wait, have you washed your hands? Right then.
welcome sight. A minute more and I'd be joining our friends on the hill here. Thanks for the assistance. I just figured everyone out here in the Forsaken Plain was either a refugee or one of the freemen. Looks like I was wrong. Actually, I'm a bit ashamed to say. I'm searching for a grave. But not just any grave. The last resting place of Azo Raymond, richest of the Twilly merchants. They say he died early in the March West, claimed by the Forsaken Plain. Rumor has it he's buried with the famous rings of Azo. I could live a year on those. I'm glad to hear it. There's plenty of ground to cover between here and Rathia to the north. And another pair of eyes will be a huge advantage. Most of the graves are along the refugee route, usually surrounded by crude markings or gestures left by loved ones. It's a pity they couldn't do more. You're kidding me! And let me guess, the rings weren't there. That's just like Azo, too smart for his own good. Was there something there that might give us a clue as to his whereabouts? Not that I would know what it is. Ugh. Bye. we were doomed. I knew oh. someone would come. They all said we were as good as dead, but I held out hope. I don't know why. Never had any reason to hope before. So what's your story? Grave robber? Treasure hunter? Or like us, a refugee in search of shelter? You did? Well, here I was about to start complaining about them. We've been trapped down here for days, unable to get past those blades, and you simply walk in and disable them, just like that. I'm impressed. I'll say thanks, but the person you're really going to want to talk to is Loma. He'd move mountains to find me. Come along now. The others are waiting back at camp. Bye.